In this series, I'm gonna be crossing America by myself and sleeping in my car. Literally all up in the snow right now. I hop on these beats, leave them all deceased in the water deep seas. Wake up, then I repeat. I locked my keys in the trunk. Oh, it's bright. All right, what's up, y'all? <sighs> I forgot to update you when I got here last night because I got here and I just hit a workout. It's nice getting active. I wanted to skate, but it's too cold. Right now it's like 31 degrees, which really isn't that bad. Like, I got this little sleeping bag and shit. A little warm, dude. I got a blanket underneath a bit too. But, um, kind of figured out last night if I lay diagonally, like, if I put my head over here and I put my feet over there. Gotta get my feet extended fully out, and that is so clutch. Yeah, man. I think it's about time to finally fucking wake up. Get up. I've been avoiding getting up, but I'm gonna go in that motherfucking Planet Fitness. I'm gonna get ready. Yeah. Hi, what's up, y'all? I'm out in this Planet Fitness right now in El Paso cooking my coffee but look at this view i didn't see this last night i could see it in the background a little bit but dang. and i know mexico's right closer here and there's like a city right over there i'm wondering if that's it but, but yeah just waiting on my coffee to boil yeah the coffee's done i love these little cookers they're so clutch i can't get over this dude that looks crazy i'm not used to it oh look at that i didn't even see all that back there tripping bro planet fitness the goat I think I'm bigger sodas. This one too. We're headed out to Mesa right now to go see my tia and I think some of my mom's cousins. Clean my windshield too. Look at that clean windshield, boy. I ain't seen that in goddamn 10 years, boy. I swear to God. But hell yes. Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> What's that one guy? Banana bread! That fucking work! You got some banana bread at work today, dude? Hell yeah. So it just goes to show that waiting for things is like worth it. But there's a lot of bad things in this world, dude. Like fucking skunks, dude. Hell no. Like getting paid not a lot of money, dude, for fucking working? Hell no. But banana bread at fucking work, dude. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, bro. That video is so fucking funny. Oh, there's a cop, so I'm putting my phone down. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> Almost got caught lacking. But yeah, I'll catch y'all there. I hop on these beats, leave them all deceased. In the water, deep seas, wake up, then I repeat. But ain't no way I lose my way out in the bay. Say, you say I'm bay. Well, show me then and hold me in. I'm closing and you're opening. Ha, that's a little much, but no fucks. I'm rapping and snapping, just having fun. Don't take me for a joke, though. I never run from smoke, ho. Wanted, we got both. I just hit my first border patrol checkpoint and I just went through there and he was like, all right, you have a good day. It took one second to look at me and it's like, all right, yeah, we're out here getting closer and closer. Ain't no way around it. Shit, where's my accountant? Who knows when I moved up Pluto, leave up with my new hoe. Please, I got a few though and they all weirdos. They be the best. I think I'm obsessed. I must confess, blessed with the best chest. Stroker like a breast and I smoke a cigarette. I'm focused on the best while you showing you a mess. I'm hoping you'll do less, but I'm knowing you'll do more. I'm holding on my breath as I open up the door. What's behind it? You're hiding. I'm finding it shining. Your highness call me Midas. Every track I rap turn to gold. Whoa, take it slow. Never made on a roll, but I'm on a roll. Taking off a clothes, smoking vegetables. Only for my health. Hit so hard it's leaving welts. And so far it's just myself. Me, myself, and I getting high. I'm a ride or die. Puffing apple pie. Loving all my life. But it wasn't always that way. I couldn't be happy. Taking perks out my face. This is what I mean by like, it looks like you just chopped the mountain off. You see that on the other side too? It looks like a W literally just carved into these mountains so we get to drive through. I think that's crazy. We're almost there, only a uh, few more hours. Cajun food, watching paid and fool, later tool. I'll see you later, won't be no favors. I'm making papers from bacon flavors. My way to savor, hot play the neighbors. Cause they thought it was real food. But now I'm just up in the stew, dude. 
guys, I found cactuses. Woo! We are here, baby. Not here, but almost. We're really close. Yeah, look at that. Need some rough edges, and the circles don't connect still. I lost a game, but want the fame and my plate filled. I've been rapping three years without a deal, so I'm taking pills to fix whatever they don't think a check will. Sprinting leg steel straight out of the left field. You see that, like, yellow layer on that shit? Looks crazy. Audio's gonna suck for a second. Look at that yellow layer. It looks so weird. Anyways, we are 30 minutes away from, uh, my Theas, so uh, we're pretty much here. It's cool. It's got mountains and shit in the background. When you think of Arizona, you just think like empty desert. You don't think of the mountains and all the other forms of life. Like it's really cool. I, I actually really like the place. It's actually Arizona is actually a really, really dope fucking place. And I, I would recommend visiting this place. Alright, guys, we made it here. I'm catching a little bit of a sunset right now. I think I'm just gonna wait. This might be the best that it gets. But I'm here. The drive was really cool. It actually was not bad at all. A lot of straight roads too, yeah. And uh, some desert and shit. There's cactuses and stuff out here. Look, I think there's a cactus right over there. You see the cactus? Look at the cactus. That's a nice cactus. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's Primavera. That is so good. Can't really see. Maybe you can see it now. Oh yeah, look at that. I'm a fucking professional filmer, dog. Look at that. Oh yeah. That's like the yellow haze that I was talking about. Sheesh. I love that shit. VB sunsets, though, I will say are very, very pretty. They'll be having all type of color. Like Virginia Beach, I swear they have the prettiest sunsets. But this is like, this is not bad at all. This is great. I like it. Anyways, yeah, whatever. I don't, I don't know. I think they got some food for me, so I'm about to eat and everything. I don't know what's going on tonight, so I don't know where I'm going to see you guys, but I'll see you guys. Two hours later. I locked my keys in the trunk. All right, so real quick story time. I, like a dumbass, went stopped at this little gas station to get some ice. To get some ice for my fucking cooler. And I locked my keys in the trunk. Because I'm just so smart sometimes. <laughs> oh my God, I thought all hope was lost. But I looked up a video and it said you could get from under these right here, push them up and it would unlock the trunk. So I pulled this off and uh, it was hard just getting that fucking thing off. Yeah, I took that off with this dude, and that didn't even end up working because it was just bare metal. But if you see that thing right there, I tried to push it up with my pepper spray, but it wasn't long enough. Fuck me. So I had to buy the screwdriver from in the store and it fucking worked and it opened my trunk and I got my keys as you can see right there. I got so lucky. At least I know how to get into my car though. If I ever get locked out again, I know how to get into it. So let's just let them learn a lesson and not do that again. But yeah, I feel so bad. She gotta wake up early. And I probably kept her up, but I am leaving now. Whew, my heart sank. Oh my God, let's get back. Let's get to Patty's house because I'm probably keeping her up and I feel really bad, but I fucking got in my car. I don't think you understand how fucking hopeless I felt, dude. I was about to call a locksmith. There was only one like 30 miles away, the closest one. Let's get the fuck out of here, bro. Fuck this shit. Not fuck this shit, but you run into these little speed bumps and shit no matter what you do in life. So you just got to try your best and keep going. I mean, if I would have given up, then I would have fucking been fucked and not been able to get in my car but i was like maybe there's a way and i looked it up the internet is so powerful you can do anything if you ever have a question or you're in a, in a jimmy fucking look it up it's online somewhere dude somewhere someone has the answers <laughs> but yeah anyways i'm getting back on the road i'm super close i'm only 30 minutes away so let's get the fuck over there i made it to patty's house i don't know i was just thinking like that whole thing that just happened is kind of like almost a lesson and it's that this whole trip has been amazing and perfect and everything has just gone so perfectly smooth but what just happened i think it's a lesson of like you know life can't always be perfect or great and good like there's always going to be something so you gotta just try your best you know whenever stuff like that happens or anything in life you just get back up after you get knocked down and you try your best skateboarding taught me that too just getting back up after you fall just trying i think effort is just a big thing a lot of people give up 
before, you know, their big break. There was like this good picture that described it. There's this miner like digging and there's gold right on the other side of where he's digging. He's quit and he gave up right before he hit the gold. So don't give up and try your hardest. That's all you can ever do is try your best and stay with your family members when you're traveling across the country. <laughs> Uh, we can't go back to what we used to have Put up on my dash, I don't want that Never want you back Sometimes when I really think about that But honestly, you were the worst thing that ever happened to me Back on Chicks Beach when I used to live on